Welcome back Pretty Souls. We are back in Township and we have got 18 hours and 15 minutes left of the Bubblegum Festival. So if we go into competition, I'm down at 18th so we've got quite a lot of plays to do and we will see how far I can get because We've only got this much time left. I obviously only go into it daily. So I assume that the next time I go in, this event will be over. So I'll let everybody know who is first place when I finish um, today. So if we go in. So I have been playing it every day since I last um, did a video. But of course, when you leave it, you everybody's playing it, so you do drop down in the competition. Um, and then again, it does feel like you're almost starting again. Um, it has got harder, as you can see. But you kind of have to get into a routine of, of getting clever at it, because it, or like I say, it, it does get harder. Uh, the green spots on the um, tables that makes the table disappear instantly so you're able to doink down quicker and we've ranked up the points so again we keep ranking the points up at the bottom and every time you hit the bar you can um, go onto the prize wheel so we're going to see what I win this time I have won, I'm sure I have that it's an Olympic, um, it's an Olympic um, pool. I'm pretty sure I have that, but we can double check once I've done the competition. Okay, so lots of plays. I'm actually maxed out on plays, which is good because obviously I can get better at the game and obviously these festivals or events they only come round um, like sometimes at certain times of the year um, oh I went a bit wrong there um, so you and, and sometimes they come around really often as well so I can show you obviously the um, professor's experiment is still going on so I can show you how I've progressed and what I've won on that. Oh, I can't get through here. Sometimes it's just being really clever and looking ahead at where you're going to drop. Sometimes you don't always know um, if they're going to disappear like that. But after so many drops, I think that's why they disappear. Because you've gone through like maybe three tables, I think that might be. And then they disappear for you and then you drop quicker. So we shall keep going. See if we can speed up maybe. Some of them are really tricky. Like there's so many red spots. You've really got to concentrate. Oh, that was rubbish. I did so well, and then I went wrong. But that's okay, because every time you go wrong, whatever you did do, you do get some points for it, so it's not all bad. Again, I went through quite a lot then, and I think that's given me double points, because I've um, gone through so many gaps quickly. And that's what happens, you see, you keep playing, and you keep getting better. Sometimes you can just have a bad day and just be absolutely rubbish, you know. That happens. But remember, it's just a game. Right. Okay. And the good thing about the um, professor's experiment that's going on at the moment is one of the um, tasks you need to do is gain stars and you gain stars on this event so that's really good because of course you're completing them on there and winning prizes as well so 
makes the game more fun, I think, when there's events and, um, and tasks to do. If you just had to go in... Oh, what does this say? Wait, you will have more tokens or buy them now. Oh, I don't want to buy tokens. Oh, okay. I've got no more plays left. I was wondering what happened there. Okay, so let's come out of there. Go into Professor's. See, I just completed the stars there. So, um, so today, so you can see like these tasks are ongoing. These are the daily tasks. And then in rewards... Obviously, I've completed quite a few at the bottom, but I've decided not to activate the gold pass, so I've not paid with my own money to get the extra things at the top, because I think the things at the bottom are more than enough for me, to be honest. I don't really need to put my own money into this game. Um, so over here, I felt like, yeah, this. I have this, don't I? And in my decorations I'm pretty sure Olympic Village I just won that so I wonder if I can sell it because I don't need it yeah I'll do that I've done that I've sold it um, I don't really have any other things going on really on here um, and I think my barn is full. Oh no, okay, let's go around and collect some um, of my fruit and veg and see if by chance I um, tick off any helicopters because that's on my tasks or... Um, any trains or uh, my zoo orders I don't think it'll make much difference but I don't have any more plays now and I've kind of we can go in and see if I've helped everybody again because that will might get me some more plays just to see where we get to because this will be my last time before that event finishes I'm sure Uh, so we've got silk. Peppers. Rice. Roses. Dandelions, coffee beans, and peanuts. So that's that on there. So I still haven't completed any more. Uh, there's no one here I can help. Let me just check this person. No, nope, I can't help them. Check John's. Oh yeah, we can help out with some trees, some rubber. Oh, oh Um, potatoes. Train some jam. into their zoo. Nope. Nope, that's it. Okay, so let's just double check. Not missing anything. There's nothing else. No. Nope. Okay, that's it for me and that competition then. So we go in. I've ended 12. And number one is Brotown. How cool is that? 
and he got 13,604 stars and as you can see look he's gonna win 50 town cash and then um, the gold um, like pet collection for the zoo animals so that'll be a really good one so that's that for that competition um, we still have the experiments going on professor's experiments so I will um, keep bringing you back for that one because we have quite a lot to do on that one and we've got 32 days so it's a good one to bring you back and see what I'm accumulating and what I'm winning. So I will do that one again. So like and subscribe for more daily content. Oh, there's someone else. Sorry. While I'm here. <laughs> ah, there we go. Okay. Anyway, as I was saying, like and subscribe for more daily content and I will see you soon. Take care.